Hello, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today we'll be talking about the very important tech skill in 2024, and that is data analysis. Okay, at the end of this video, you will understand what is data analysis. You will also know the rules of the data analysis, and you will also know the processes of data analysis. Finally, you will know the skills of a data analyst. Okay, but before we dive into this discussion for today, I want to do something very important, which is to click the like button and turn off your notification button so that when we post video like this, you'll be one of the first persons to watch it. So, as I said, we'll be talking about data analysis. So, what is data analysis? Data analysis is the process of inspecting collecting, analyzing, cleaning, transforming data to make useful uh, information from raw data. And this information will help in business growth and organization development. So the job of a data analyst is to get all this raw data, analyze it, interpret it, and present it to stakeholders, which help to make informed decisions. Okay. So at this point, we are going to look at the different rules of the data analyst and these rules include, but not limited to, to predict future sales and purchasing behavior, to guide a company from fraud, and also to analyze the effectiveness of market campaigns. As we said, the role of a data analyst in a business can never be overemphasized. So these people are sought after. If you want to make it big in 2024, you may want to learn data analysis. So at this point, we'll be looking at the different process of data analysis. There are about five processes for analyzing data, which number one is defining the problem. You have to define the problem. You ask yourself questions. What are the things you're looking for? What do you want to solve? So you develop them as questions. You develop them as problems and hypotheses. That's the number one step. Then the data Second. collection. At this point, you decide what kind of data you need, what are the sources of your data, is it primary data, is it secondary data. After data collection, the next one is to clean your data. This is where the job is. This is where you spend a lot of time. Because if you don't clean the data, it will affect the output of your findings. Now, in this point of cleaning the data, you have things like removing blank spaces, uh, duplicated uh, data, um, things like data redundancy, you know, you, you know, things like wrong spelling. This, at this point, you clean the data. Now, after cleaning the data, the next one is analyzing the data. Okay. At least there are a lot of statistics methods in analyzing data, ranging from regression analysis, correlation, trend lines, and all that. So at this point, you are now analyzing the data that you've gotten and you've cleaned. The next thing you're going to do is to interpret it and present it to stakeholders. And you're going to make it as simple as possible. And they are visualization tools you can make use of, such as Tableau, Power BI. There are many visualization tools that you can use in what presenting your data. Then after now, we're going to be talking about the basic skills for a data analyst. Now, these skills are divided into two. We have the soft skill and we have the hard skill, okay? Now, when we're talking about the soft skill, if you must be a good data analyst, number one soft skill that you want to have is having an analytic mindset. Analytic mindset. To be someone who is analytic in nature. Then the next soft skill you have is problem solving skill. Come on. Data analysis is all about solving problems. And that's why it's a course that you sought after. You are in need just to solve problems. So you must have the problem solving skill. The next soft skill you have is a communication skill. You cannot be a good data analyst when you cannot communicate your findings. You have a wonderful findings. You must learn how to communicate them to stakeholders. Then the next soft skill I want to mention here is teamwork. Because as a data analyst, you'll be working with team. Come on, you'll be working with team. You, uh, that's one of the things. So you must understand how to collaborate with people. You must understand people's skills. Talking about the hard skill, which is also the technical skill every 
data analysis should go. Number one on my list is the spreadsheet. The spreadsheet is the fundamental of data analysis. And we have so many of them, such as Microsoft Excel, the Google Sheet, and so many other. The second hard skill a data analyst should have is understanding visualization tools. There are many visualization tools, but the popular ones are Power BI and Tower View. Then now go deep and you're talking about structure query language with SQL. So at that point, you will learn how to query data from different databases. Okay, then we'll talk about the R programming language. They'll talk about Python. So these are the technical skills you will learn as a data analyst. If you have watched to this point, I want to say thank you for watching. If you want to learn data analysis, I will recommend Digital Dream ICT Academy. Digital Dream ICT Academy, they have qualified tutors, they are project based, and they are student center. You can visit any of our branches around Southeast or call the number below to book a slot. Thank you.